All right, so what we have here is some little tests that I've done with a RFID reader. This is the RC522. I have this hooked up to an Arduino that we know with a NeoPixel light ring right here. And basically, I'm using this library for it. Um, it's a bunch of different examples. You can look at this code. I'll put a link to it in the GitHub. And the example that I'm using is the RFID dump info, where we're basically just looking through all the different information that we can get from an RFID tag. Um, this sensor is basically used to read and write to do different RFID tags. They even come with a little key fob that you can use. Um, today I'll be using magic bands instead. Is Everyone knows they use RFID technology inside them. So let's take a look at the code real quick. <coughs> this is a little bit of the setup for the different pins. And basically what I'm doing is I'm using a read function, which is illustrated right here, to get the different bytes of information from the RFID tag through the sensor. And then based on the information that I get, I do a comparison and do a different color sequence for each different RFID tag. We'll be able to see the information come through here in the serial output for the Arduino. So first, let's try out this pink one. You can see the light turn pink. You're able to get some information out of there. The UID in both hex and the string that I'm comparing against. Now we can try red. Let's keep going. We'll do orange. Try yellow. That's green. We got blue. And nice purple. So as you can see, the different colors went on the light ring as we read them, and the different UIDs over here are represented. Now these are the UIDs of the actual bands themselves. They're not associated to a specific account or any person, but the actual RFID tag inside them. So now let me see if I can go ahead and turn up the brightness a little bit for you on the ring. Hopefully it's not too bright. And we'll be able to do one more run through just so you can see the colors a little bit better. There you go, so that's a bright ring. So there's pink. Here's red. There's orange. Here's yellow. Here's green. There's blue. And there's purple. Hopefully that time you can see the difference between the purple and the blue. You can even do custom functions. Here's one. It's doing like a little rainbow dazzle that I put to a specific band. So that's just a little bit of a intro of what you can do with an RFID reader.